Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> well, today is the day that we are finally packing all up. <laughs> we are packing all of our stuff to move out. Um, the reason Haley's standing in front of the fan like that is because it's like 98 degrees today with humidity, like on top of it. It is insanely hot. Um, we've been moving. It's 3, 3.30ish. We've been moving since like 10 this morning. So it's just... My AC is out. My AC is broken. It's just a great combination. Great day to move out. Anyways, we, we have a U-Haul outside and now we're just packing up my house. We got Haley's house done. I didn't record any of that because I left the camera here, but we picked up a 15 foot U-Haul, loaded it with her stuff and like a bunch of house stuff. And now we're doing mine, which is all this that you see here. So this is our progress so far. Most of the boxes are gone. I have a few little things. I actually have two of these giant jars full of change and they're That's really the heavy. Why don't you just dump the change? Uh, I don't know. But anyways, so I just got like- Why do you want the change so bad? <sighs> I have a thing full of change because in Journey to the Center of the Earth, they travel using all of his like jars of change. So that's why I have my own jars of change. Okay, but turn it into cash. And then put the but it's not as fun in cash. Anyways, we're just trying to get those last couple things done. We're taking, if you guys have ever seen our DIY, we're actually taking this table with us. We were trying to sell it, um, or we thought about selling it, and we never no, actually did. We were going to sell it, and then Brian said, I want it. So we never sold yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. So now it's there, and we're taking it with us. Um, I got to figure out what I'm doing with the rest of the stuff in my office because the TV has gone, all the sound bar and stuff is gone. I just got to figure out what I'm doing with these. Uh, so this is our U-Haul that we have. It's not very full, but we had to get this U-Haul if we wanted to get a trailer to tow her car. So we have this, this giant empty U-Haul. But uh, we're done loading, so we're going to go... We're gonna go get her car hooked up to this thing. Yeah. So this is the truck that we showed you earlier. And we just hooked it up to Haley, to a trailer and Haley's car is on it. And we're loading the last few things, just like a mattress and stuff into the car, into the truck. <sighs> Done. Take that out. And this might be our last Big B. A long time. We don't have Big B in Texas. We should start a petition. A petition for Bigby? Yeah. I forgot how I did this last time. Thanks, Here. Dad. No, no problem. I was laughing because from the, the truck you Okay, don't mind the way we look, but we're on the road, headed to Texas. We got a very late start. We left like four hours later than we wanted to because we didn't wake up. So we tried leaving at two. It did not happen. It did not. So now we look like this. And yeah. yeah. But we're on the road. So it is 10:38 in the morning, and we tried to get McDonald's, but apparently McDonald's doesn't. So they have like all-day breakfast now, but they don't have all-day like lunch. So we just went, and it's 10:30. So they have breakfast, they don't have lunch, but like later in the day they have breakfast and lunch. So I don't understand why they wouldn't just serve lunch all the time. So I just got a drink and I ate my donut from earlier. But we have, we've only been on the road for about three hours now. Uh, we're 17 hours away from Texas. So we still got a long ways to go, but it's been, driving this thing honestly isn't that bad. It's pretty, it's just like dri driving a normal car. You just gotta be careful when you're turning. That's about it. And my dad packed us sandwiches. Okay, so we have a little difference in preference. We stopped at Jimmy John's and Subway. It's so hot. So, <laughs> thank goodness we have AC or we would not make it. There's a heat advisory out. It is like so, humid as yeah, balls. It's, it's been hot, but we're gonna get some food in our system. Jimmy John's Kick and Ranch is like the bomb.com if you haven't tried it. Back on the road. Five more hours for today and then 10 tomorrow. So I had to unwrap his sub and put half of it with mine so that he can eat without making a mess. I'm and still gonna still spill gonna it. Make a mess. I'm still gonna spill it, 100%. Oh, Yeah. 
mai Okay, first part of the first part of the vlog that's even out of the car. We've stopped at this like Shake Shack thing um, to get food for the night. We're only at Big John Shake Shack. We're only like 30 minutes away from the house though, or the apart or apartment, the hotel that we're staying at tonight. So yeah. Anyways, this is our, our U-Haul. Right there. So that's that's what we've been driving forever. I gotta get some shorts because I'm still wearing sweatpants from this morning. So that's, that, that's yeah. But since we're only like 30 minutes away, we're just gonna eat and then finish on our way to the hotel. Hey, I'm gonna put shorts on real quick. Alright, let's go see how good this place is. Gotta go to a hole in the wall place if you're gonna road trip. Yeah, that's true. You okay? <laughs> okay, review of Bob Shake Shack is Delicious. freaking amazing. 100% would go here again. I'm just checking to make sure the car is still here. All right, yep, yep, okay, well, car's still there, we're good. So, the road we were just on, <laughs> on the expressway, was like bouncing, and we were just going up and down, and I could not stop oh laughing because I just felt so ridiculous. That was hilarious. It was great. <laughs> my God. We're almost there. Woo! Like five minutes to the hotel. Okay, we've realized it's a specific type of pavement. It's coming up. I don't know if you can see it, but we <laughs> we are just understand. bouncing. Okay, this one's not doing it as much. Uh, it's not doing it as much as it was, it's but turn. oh my goodness, it it's was, the most ridiculous yeah. thing. Cause you're just a ghost inside my head. You're just a ghost. Okay, so this is the hotel Haley picked us out for the night. The girl at the front counter is actually super nice and super cool, so that's a good start. We weren't very sure when we saw this, but it turned out to be a-okay.